2019 Aston Martin Vantage Review. Ew. Aston Martin's current Vantage, launched in 2005, has long suffered an identity crisis. With design cues cribbed from the larger, more expensive DB Grand Trismus, and powertrain and suspension hardware that never quite delivered the precision and performance expected of a car intended to tackle Porsche's quicker 911s and entry-level Ferraris, the entry-level Aston struggled to make a convincing case as a pure sports car. The 2019 Aston Martin Vantage changes all that. With unique styling that shrink wrap sex appeal, and a chassis in powertrain optimized for performance and handling, the new Vantage is most definitely an Aston Martin on a mission, on a mission. Before continue, please subscribe, share and comment. Thank you. Q. The new Vantage rolls on a version of the new DB11 platform that's been shortened 4 inches. Though the front two-thirds of the platform is effectively shared with the DB11 V8, Aston Martin claims 70% of its components are new or have been upgraded. Among the key changes are a completely new rear end structure that features a solidly mounted rear subframe, and a repositioned gas tank. The Vantage also gets an e-diff the first ever fitted to an Aston Martin, and rolls on specially developed 20-inch Pirelli P0 tires. Under the hood is the AMG-developed, 503-horsepower 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 engine that also powers the new DB11 V8. The engine is set low, and as far back in the chassis as possible, to help deliver perfect 50 hours 50 minutes weight distribution. Peak power arrives at 6,000 revolutions per minute, and peak to work of 505 pounds to foot is developed between 2,000 revolutions per minute and 5,000 revolutions per minute. As in the DB11s, the engine drives the rear wheels via a ZF8 speed automatic transmission. Aston Martin claims the new Vantage weighs about 3,400 pounds and is capable of accelerating from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.5 seconds, and reaching a top speed of 195 miles per hour, per hour.